All right, let's play another game. Maximize my screen. Random, random. Oh, let's pick a deck this time. The opponent, well, we'll do random for the opponent, but for me, let's do Archangel, Archangel, Arch. <laughs> High Priest. I wonder what that is. No. Let's do Archangel. Get that Sarah Angel. Uh, okay. Always play first. Conjure. Play first. Not bad. Apprentice Wizard, start to do it. Okay. Game one life uses ability only when a creature is put into any graveyard from play and only once for each such creature. Okay, who am I? Archangel, cool picture. One and done. Get my vultures out. At the end of any turn in which a creature was put into any graveyard from play, put a carry on counter on vultures, remove two counters, get plus one, plus one until end of turn. Okay. Oh wow, he must be having trouble with land. Aladdin's ring deals four damage to target creature to play. Fine, you let's put into a graveyard from play. Gain to life. Get those vultures going. First blood. First blood. First blood. Fast effects. Nothing. Yeah, he's got nothing. He's discarding. Another soul. Tetra versus six. Getting any mana. Oh well. Hmm. Giant tortoise. Finally, 
like last game, I kept trying to figure out how to get these. You got to do it during the upkeep. Cast spells. To get those tokens off the Tetravis. Look, it skipped. See, how do I, how do I do that? When Tetravis and it comes in, put, put three counters on. During your upkeep, you may move each of these as long as the carries. It didn't even stop though during my upkeep. Uh, ah. Uh, Mark this phase to always stop. Hmm, okay. Yeah, we'll toy with them a little bit. Oh, too late. That's another thing, you can't take it back. This isn't this isn't kitchen table magic where you can say, oops, I didn't mean to attack with that. And take it back. Once you click, you're done. Okay. Same goes for mana burn. Oops, I forgot to play my Sarah Angel. That's right. They can't get any land. This is a good, good learning game. Okay, there. Now it stopped. Okay, perfect. Move all three tokens. Oh, that's cool. That's a cool image. I've never seen that before. Um... A token, the token for the Tetravite counts as an artifact creature. Tetravite cannot have enchantments played on it. Very cool. I wonder if, yeah, that's got to be a Mark Teton uh, image as well. Cool. Very cool. Get my Osai vultures. Wonder what else untapped front of this phase. Mark this phase to always stop. Okay. Mark this phase to always stop. Mark this phase to always stop. Mark this phase. Upkeep. Help for this phase. Upkeep phase. Okay. Interesting. This is really good if you're learning to play magic. Of course, I mean, it's all, if you want to play vintage magic or anything before the 2010 rules, because mana burn, you no longer have that. And there's all sorts of other things that have changed. But uh, yeah, I think they just came out with the beta for Magic Arena. I wonder if there's a way I can play people online with this. Felwar Stone at your mana pool. One man of any type that any opponent's lands can produce. Plays ability as a blah blah blah. As a mana source. Sweet. Untap. Untap. Now I can move back. Let's move these two tetravites. Yes, activate tetravite. Cool. Very cool. All right, now for the kill.
graphic details, invisible effects. Hmm. Okay, yeah, I'm still learning. Go for the kill. Unsummon planes. Very good.